Welcome to the Amazing Place competition. It's amazing! Oh. We're on nationals. We're international now. <laughs> Welcome, madam. When a pirate ship came along for me, came along for me. Woo! You feeling great? Stack your hands, stack your hands, stomp your feet. When a pirate ship came along for me, came along for me. Who's going to sing the Wayata? Tehei Māori ora, tēnā koutou, tēnā koutou, tēnā tātou katoa. Good afternoon, mums and dads and teachers, but most especially boys and girls. Thank you for the mihi aroha, that was very beautiful. It's wonderful to have with us today the Prime Minister of New Zealand, the Right Honourable John Key. Mr Key, thank you for joining us in our city again. Is there anybody from Burnside High here? I can't hear you. Is there anyone from Burnside here? There is. Cool, that's very good. Um, so this is one of your old boys, is that right? Getting older all the time, it's a tough job. And of course, we've also got the Minister of Earthquake Recovery, Mr. Jerry Brownlee. Welcome along, Mr. Brownlee. And we've got uh, Nikki uh, Wagner, who's uh, here with us today. And we also have our Associate Minister of Earthquake Recovery, just gone blank in my head. Amy. Amy Adams, that's right, of course, just testing her, and she got the name right. Well done. And there's uh, the mayoress, my wife, 
uh, Joanna. And also, that's good. Thank you for that, Amy. And also, we've got the lovely Benicia. And uh, Benicia is the acting chief executive of the Canterbury Earthquake Recovery Authority and a great person to work with. So it's lovely to have you here. And also from the BNZ, we have Andy. So shall we say um, a big kia to all those people together? Would you do that for me? One, two, three. Fantastic. So who are the other schools? I, I saw we've got some people from Rolston. Uh, where are you guys from? Mount Summers, that's an amazing place. I think we saw Cathedral Grammar. Uh, the kids from Freeville are here. Who else? Shout it out. Well, that's them. They're the quiet ones over there, right? Who else have we got? Selwyn House, thank you. Amy knows everything. Who have I missed? Okay. Well, you're all very, very welcome here. It was so exciting coming in today and seeing all of the finalists out there in that first tent when you came in and realizing just how creative the young people of Christchurch are and what an important day this is because you've had a big say in creating one of the exciting projects that we're able to bring you as we rebuild and recreate our city, an amazing place, and that is what today is all about. And I really loved the number of tree huts that I saw out there. And was it the, the Tanifa slide? And there were all sorts of brilliant, brilliant ideas. And, and now imagine how difficult it's going to be for the uh, staff and the designers to turn those all into uh, actual parts of this wonderful new uh, playground that we'll have in our city. And it's going to add to the one that we still have in the Botanic Gardens, which we're also restoring and bringing it back just the way it's been for many, many years, the way that many people love it. So some great facilities for young people in the city. I really want to thank uh, the staff from the Christchurch City Council who had to do the judging. Uh, that's a really hard job to do because you've all done such an outstanding job. So thank you for being here. And like you, I'm very excited to find out who the winner is going to be. So from wherever you have come today, you're very welcome in this special place. Thank you. Oh, he's taken my seat. <laughs> thank you, Mayor Bob, and thank you, Naitahu. And the children of Freeville School, I understand there are 80 of you here today, so welcome. Now, this is a celebration of the input almost 6,000 children have had into the the design of the new playground to be built in the East Frame. Now we're going to see a sample of their work. Well, we are making these playgrounds. This is my big playground which I have designed. All the playgrounds that I've seen too, we haven't really seen any climbing walls like this before. We wanted there to be more yoke inside our playground, so we what we could put more yard around our drinking fountain, just like this. Hi, my name's Jackson and this is Rocket Land, the model that I have made. Well, you climb up the stairs if you don't have special needs. Or you climb up the escalator if you don't have special needs and you land in the foot. Basically what it is here is a slide, a seesaw and a, what I call a rocking car, which is you put a penny in and it starts rocking back and forth automatically. And then you go into the mouth and sit down on your book and then go down and go to make a slide and finish into a sandpit. And there's a flying fox. We have a swing set here, a cart track, and you get off the vehicle and have an experience in the rocket. This is the, um, the Captain Cook's my ship, the dolphin rock rockers, um, the silver fern swings, the walker. I'll see you all in the dark. <laughs> That's silly. We can't fit on a duck. <laughs> That's like, I don't know, it's called a rocker by string pull. Because you, cause you pull this string and it like rocks around. You go like, oh, like a go. circle. Oh, and you go like, oh, oh. And um, this is our slide and um, it's got this padding here so you don't um, hurt your bum when you slide down. A goose? 
<laughs> a goose is a good one. That's big enough. So I thought it'd be a nice new way to, you know, brighten up Christchurch and get it running again. Christchurch needs to be better and stronger. Christchurch is going to be an amazing place! Yeah! Now it gives me great pleasure to invite our Prime Minister, the Right Honourable John Key, to say a few words. Prime Minister. Thank you. So hello, it's great to see you all. How are you? Good. This is going to be the most fun part of my day today, okay? Come and see all the new playground designs and have your competition. Is this the best part of your day? Okay, oh, well, it's going to be a lot of fun. Now, can you tell me, do you like going to a playground? Yeah. Sorry, I can't hear you. What was that? Do you like coming to a playground? Yeah. No, you're just not trying hard enough. Do you like coming to a playground? Yeah. Right. This is very much like being in a National Party conference, you'd be pleased to know. Okay, well done. So, um, I like going to playgrounds as well, and... Um, as a kid, I used to love going to playgrounds. And do you know what? The modern playground is so different to the one I used to go on. So we used to have those things that spin around a bit in case you feel a bit giddy when you came off those. And we had the slides and we had the swings. We didn't have anything like rockets and all the things that we're seeing designed here. So your playground is going to be fantastic. So well done for all of you being in the competition. I think there's been 6,000 6, people were involved in 300 entries. So that's pretty cool, isn't it? And in the end, the, the best one's going to be built here, um, as they said, in the frame. So that's going to be fantastic. So I want to thank the companies that are going to make that possible. So BNZ, AIG Insurance and Fletcher's for being involved. But most of all, we want to thank you guys for putting your brains into making sure that you de uh, deliver something that's really cool and fun place to be. So when it's finished, you're going to go to the playground? Yeah! Cool, okay. Has anyone had a cupcake yet? Really? Yeah. <laughs> Are they nice? Yeah. Cool. Okay, well, I'm going to have one after this too. Okay, so good luck for anyone that's a winner, and congratulations. That'll be all of you guys, and I look forward to seeing you on the stage. But well done, and I can't wait to go to the playground when it's finally built. Okay? See you there. Bye-bye. Thank you, Prime Minister. And now you're going to present the prizes. Prime Minister, now you're going to present the prizes. Now to read out the names of the winners, I welcome Andy Simmons from our principal sponsor, the BNZ. On behalf of the um, Bank of New Zealand, I'd just like to say congratulations to all of the playground designers that are here today. What an amazing set of playgrounds I've seen. Uh, and thank you for putting your time and energy into coming up with some really creative and fantastic ideas. My kids at home, Henry, Millie and Charlotte, they're not in Christchurch, but they would have loved to have had a go at designing playgrounds. And they tell me that they would have had some trained unicorns as well as a flying fox from every kid's house back to the Amazing Place playground. <laughs> at uh, the BNZ, we really love giving people what they need and empowering them to get on and do what they need to do. And I'm really pleased to see you doing that as you've designed your playgrounds. It's really important that you have your say in what this city looks like in the future because one day it is going to be your future and your city. BNZ is behind this competition, not just for this bit, the, for the whole bit. So next we're going to be working with some bigger kids on helping them understand how you do all the money stuff around building a new playground. So we're looking forward to that as well. I'm looking forward to coming back later this year to talk you through the work that the bigger kids have done. But again, congratulations to all our playground designers here today. You rock, guys. Well done. Awesome, guys. And then for year six, in first place, we have Harriet Compton, Moen, Sal Logan, Enya O'Malley, and Lucy Jessup from Selwyn House. Well done, guys.
Selwyn House, I'd just like you to please stay on stage for a minute. Thank you. First, um, thank you, Andy, from BNZ. Um, I know your, your bank is so proud to be part of today, and we thank you for your bank sponsorship and for being here to present the prizes. Now, Selwyn House, come over this way. Who would like to be the spokesperson and tell me what your amazing playground is all about, the best playground in the world? Is it you? Okay, come on up. Now tell us about your playground. Um, it's a Margaret Mahe Memorial Playground based on Margaret Mahe's books. Fantastic. And did you see it when you came in the doors today? Yeah. How cool was it to see it in the, in the small little dome out there? Pretty cool. What about you girls? What was your involvement with it? Um, come right up to the microphone. We had to help out with coming up with all the things in the playground. Cool. And what about you? What was your what was your part of it? Uh, I designed the ch trampoline chair. And can you explain to us a little bit about that? It's based on down the back of the chair. It's a chair with and you climb up netting, and on top it's a trampoline. Very cool. So did you did you girls enjoy creating it? Yes. So it was just the three of you. Mm. And wow. Lucy, Lucy Jessup, but she's moved to England. England. Oh. <laughs> I think you've rehearsed that. I like it. <laughs> now, thank you so much, girls, but that is not all. The judges were so impressed by your entry, they decided to, it deserved a special award. And I'd like to ask Margaret Mahi's daughter, Penny Mahi, to join us on stage and present a special prize to each of the girls. But wait, there is even more. Please stay on stage, girls, and you too, Penny, as the Prime Minister has a few more words to say. Prime Minister. So I've got a very special announcement to make now, and that is I'm delighted to announce that the playground that has been designed is going to be named after Margaret Mahi. The playground will be called the Margaret Mahi Amazing Place, and just as Margaret Mahi's books captured the imagination of generations of New Zealanders, this playground will be a place for people of all ages to enjoy. So can we say a big thank to, thanks to Margaret Mahi's family for allowing Christchurch to honour Margaret in this wonderful way for kids to enjoy for years and years to come. Well done. Thank you so much, Prime Minister, Penny, and this amazing team from Selwyn House. You're all allowed to go and sit down now. <laughs>